All right, it's RNT by Sarah back in the episode of Final Fantasy Mystic Quest. And we got battlefields. Oh, do we have battlefields? This might be an all battlefield episode. How's that sound? I don't know the most exciting thing, but. I mean, hey, it's working. I don't have much in the way of news, but our BG Maker MD released. I played a little with it, not too much. No, I'll just fish them off with a fire each. And from what I've seen, I like it so far. I mean, there's some changes, and they did have tutorial that was at least decent. I got nothing much other than that. You know what? That's how heal works. I hope you guys know I did accidentally mess up the refresher thing while well, the tutorial on it. There is no actual Feast Down replica, it actually is a stat healer. That's my doing. And yeah, we're just gonna torch things. I mean, hey, it's working. But I did find out I did lose a few projects a little bit, but... I did find a backup for most of them. I just had to reroute one or two of them and pull one of my old, pull a copy off itch.io and remake it. You know how it's not that bad. Like these battles. Also, I think I was kind of wrong on something, which after looking at these, I think these are just actual enemy battles. I thought they were special ones that happened in like boss type ones, but I think that's just my brain on. I have no energy. I'm not thinking anymore. Go do your own thinking, dummy. But we do need to at least take a couple of these down, specific ones. Like, the charm one was really worth it. There's another one we're going to be doing soon that's going to be worth it. Trust me. This is at least going to be one that's worth it. I mean, the charm alone, having more defense is worth it and getting all the items, but... Well, I'm talking for useful. You'll find out. Last fight here, and I'll go heal up and we'll take on the second one. Bye. Two, three, four, five, six. Clean them out. One, three hundred gold. All right. That's only gold. Use up the last of the seeds, but that's fine. We'll get more. All right. I really want to say the scorpions are fire. No, they're actually weak. Wow. Well, I forgot. Nine more to go. So, flame scorpions, got it. I mean, it's not a hard concept now. You find weakness, you use a weakness, you just clean out the area, and then you go have a treat. Go have a Coke. Or Pepsi, whatever your bag is. You know, it's a nice iced tea. Whatever your favorite drink is, go ahead get a glass after you beat all these guys. Because that's all you need to do. Just make sure your spell holds out. Like I said, I did get a hold of RPG Maker MZ. I did do the tutorial at least. 
you know, most of our already knew. It is worth doing though, just to get at least a base project and remember what the heck you're supposed to be doing. Plus, I always try to make a base project that has some simple things in case I forget. It's gonna be so much different now that Yanfly's retired. I remember my first one I entered with didn't do so well. One of the things I did was look for some plugins to help me because I had no knowledge of them at the time. And I discovered his site. So I put a few plugins in and, well, a few other changes and came out a little better. Since then I've used his plugins because they actually do help me a little bit. But the thing is, everyone starts to get sick of it because everyone uses them because they're so freaking good. Oh, I'm at spells there, all right. Yeah, I'm at a point where we're going to be seeing some stuff happen. I did hear other people are doing actual amazing work on stuff, so... I am looking to see what I can do to change things up and fix it. Hey, a magic ring! I told you there'd be one that was worth it. Magic ring! As a defense of three, we've taken off the charm and we've upgraded it. We now get a silence protection. We can't be silenced. The road down here is always what you have on. And you'll always have the best stuff automatically equipped. So there's ten, five, eight. This is now useless. It's just there to show that you've gotten it. There are three levels to everything and you will get all of them. Hopefully. Same with weapons, you'll always use the best set of weapons, and we're missing one. <coughs> oh, I'm okay. I gotta hit an end up and heal. Ah, oh, good healing. Healing good. Alright. Next up, third battlefield. Oh, these guys. The Edge Hogs. I do believe fire does work. Yep. They're not edgy enough and they lose and they get a freaking reverse mohawk when they take enough damage. Yes. Note that there is another use for me doing me this, not just my own benefit. It's actually giving us levels. Level ups. And we just toast and roast and cook everything and get it over with. Hey, level 11, sweet. Sonic Hedgehog! Nope. Yeah, the difficulty has just gone into orbit. Like, after we started to level up and really started get, to get going, we took the table that the difficulty was on and flipped it so hard, you just see the difficulty spike go flying. Because now we're actually in control of everything. We have a little bit more option. We have a little bit more control. We can easily get more critical hits and stuff in. We can exploit weakness, which is a common RPG element. And we just mow things. I mean, these hedgehogs just get roasted and cooked. That's all you have to do.
And there's so many good things you can get here too by doing this right. I mean, look, we got a magic charm. That already helps. Watch this be an amazing spell or something. Or just be like thunder. Did the enemy 270, found six, clean them out, 199. Okay, it was just XP, but hey, XP is good. Now with all the money we want, we can go right in and heal up, and I guess we'll go hit Wintry Cave. I know, I'm just doing this for the spells. That's where all my money goes. All 835. Yeah, I'm not kidding. We got money. Mm, all right, Wintry Cave. We might not finish this today, but... Well, look at all the damage we've already done. <coughs> I'm okay. Something just got into my throat. Nothing serious. Yeah, I have the weird feeling for KFC right now. Oh well. Just gotta keep plugging. Explosive recharge plus ten. Hmm. Are they trying to say something? Ah. I mean, it's easy to cook the enemies. You just sit there cooking them, roasting them, making dinner out of them, and so you're in the next area. Well, you're upstairs and find more. Remember by the time Phoebe leaves the party, we should be around her level at least. Like the rule of thumb is you should be at your partner's level around by the time you leave. At least I think. Hedgehog's weak against fire, weak against fire, but not those things. So I'll just attack with axe. We'll use the cat claw. And we ow. This claw saved me. Here's how you use it. Select the claw, hold the A button down, and press the control pad. Now it's yours. We get cat claw, she gets arrows. Her arrows do use ammo, and we will be getting ammo for it. So make sure you keep some ammo. I hope we find some seeds soon, because we need a couple. Hmm. I'm just going around taking out enemies, gang stuff. You know, the standard. Fire week. I mean, we do have a lot to go through here. All right. I'll play like that. Oh, that's not good. Oh, well. I'm okay. You're done. And... Bah! Phoebe's good with her magic. I think I need to go back a little bit, though. Nope, I know what I'm doing. 
Always use fire first. See about weakness. No weakness there. All right. Let me go with centaurs a week too. I'll try Quake. And I love the face that they make the scared face. That's funny. Refresher is something I don't really use. Okay, you're a scorpion. Walls need a claw. Is and I'm over there and there's an item down. I gotta go back and get. That's fine. Get rid of the hedgehog. Oops. Wrong weapon. Uh, you know what? Just attack. Off your bow. There we go. Thunder. Ho. Nope. No. 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 Well, we're back to normal, but... The attacks of the bow. It's critical. I'll quake it. Alright, what's in the chest? Please be see. Nope, cure potions. Well, we got another centaur here. I'll take it out real quick. XP! Money! Items! Explosions! We got them all! Get out. Get out. One left on. Huh. I'll try bomb. Nope. Well, level up and we got him. That works. Hold the A button and you walk around on the wall. Heal potions, oh, you don't need them at all. You hold yourself up and then you hit and then you release to do the sliding down. Thank you, thank you. And that was the song on how to use your cat claw. Brought to you by Benjamin and the band. Make sure you tip your weight, staff. You're actually out. That's not good. I can do enough damage where I can just do this. And out. We. Hedgehogs. I'll let you heal. Hedgehogs! Hedgehogs! Gone. And another scorpion. And we're out of fire. <coughs> that ain't good. Oh, you have to lock in your choice before you use it. Oh, I guess I'll use my last thunder. Well, I got rid of them. This ain't good. We're running out of spells. I 
She attacks. Strong against blind, but doesn't matter. Dead. Also dead. All right, we're doing okay. Well, I'm out. Oof. Break into a safe spot. I'm completely out of spells. That ain't good. Okay, she doesn't have damage with her bow. But I don't. No bombs. Cat Claw. I have paralyzed, but he's strong against it. Good to know, though. Cure. Arrows. Oh, that's not good. Well, we're in a pickle. I'm going to save the game here. And I'm going to end it. I hope you had fun, and I'll see you on the next one. See you then. Uh -oh.